We made it last night with a little bit of daylight to spare. It's a beautiful spot on the banks of the Pentecost. That's the crossing just over there, so we're just packing up at the moment. We'll make our way across there. We are actually bogged at the moment too, as we were pulling in last night. Got a bit soft sand and we sort of started to sink in a little bit and I guess with all that's where we'll camp. So we're just doing a bit more packing up this morning. We're not too badly bogged. We should just be able to get out with the max tracks. I get the easy job just uh, filming away while he digs away. Hey love. There is a life I lead in this city Hurrying to cut my teeth I can take what I need to get by It doesn't make it easy yeah, the peace of my heart moves slow Somewhere in the great unknown When I return from the afterglow Will you carry me like I am whole again? Wait, hold on Put me together, take me back where I belong I want it all Back where I belong I want it all I had a feeling But the feeling is all gone Take you back to my youth And show you what I wish I'd knew My will is strong with a place to lean In the moment I hung best belief The other ring of my wrist is gold Pairing with the light it holds When I return from my spinning ball I'm remembering the words you told me Back where I belong I want it all I had a feeling But the feeling is all gone Wait. Just as we were pulling out of the driveway From Ellenbray Station After enjoying some fresh scones We ran into the bike riders On the Gibb River Challenge The Gibb River Challenge is a 660k bike ride That's run every year With these crazy men and women Riding the entire length of the Gibb River Road Raising plenty of money for charity to Drysdale Station at the moment. We had all intention of making it all the way up to Mitchell Falls, but the road from here up to Mitchell Plateau is still closed. The grader is out there currently. So while we're at Drysdale, we decided, seeing as we can't drive up there, we might as well go for a fly up there. So this morning we're going for a two and a half hour scenic flight. 
um, Twas S right out over the coast, see quite a few other things rather than just Mitchell Falls. So, first, first time in a plane for Caitlin, so uh, yeah. That was awesome. That's it, next spot. Best time ever in a Amazing. Amazing. Well Amazing. worth it. It's not as scary as Dad makes it. <laughs> <laughs> our plane ride was all we filmed at our short stay at Drysdale River Station. They did have all the facilities you'd expect at a caravan park the toilets, hot showers, and a few washing machines to wash out some of the red dust. From here, we kept pushing further west along the Gibb River Road towards Manning Gorge. Bloody radio aerial started to come loose. <laughs> the corrugations on that road, on this road, have been pretty gnarly. But he's fixing it. Oh no, I think it broke. Uh oh, I think it's broken. Houston, we have a problem. Oh dear. tell me I took this video too far and I probably did. <laughs> so, so serious. Oh no, can you fix it? I think so. I think the bottom of the cable is just the little grub screw that holds it in is obviously slipped out. Righto. If you do find yourself on the Columbaroo Road, just between the Gibb River Road, Columbaroo Junction and the Gibb River, there is a little point of interest on Wikicamps. There is some Aboriginal art. A little bit hard to find and it is all fenced off, so I don't know whether you can actually see it on the GoPro or not, but a couple of cool little spots. It's a bit of a shame that everything's gonna get fenced off nowadays. Can't even see it.
gym trail is not wet. <laughs> 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 Barnett River was a little bit deeper than intended and our camper trailer does not seal up so I'm a little bit nervous what we're going to find when we unfold it because the back does not seal up very well. <sighs> See how wet our bed is. Good morning from Manning Gorge. Caitlin's not going swimming today. Caitlin doesn't want to go swimming. It's a nice little walking trail that goes up to the waterfall at Manning Gorge here. But the first part of the trail, it's a pretty specky one because you go straight across the water. And it is quite deep. We came down for a little swim last night and it's pretty cool. They give you these little half barrels so you can put your, your backpack and everything in there and then swim it across to the other side and then Keep walking. Yeah. All right, dry and dressed again. The river was nice. On with the trail. Let's go find a waterfall. probably the most specky one we've been to I reckon. It's a 5k return walk so it's not that bad really but swing around here mate. Have a look at that. <laughs> All in all, Manning Gorge was absolutely amazing, with probably what we would rate as the most amazing swimming hole at the campground in the whole of the Kimberley. Now from this point on, we did make our way further across to Bell Gorge, Winjana Gorge and Tunnel Creek, but unfortunately I have to admit, this is the first trip that we've actually taken any film on, and all we had for storage was a few SD cards and a MacBook, and unfortunately I lost a hell of a lot of footage, so from this point on, all you're going to see is a few little GoPro videos that I managed to salvage and download onto my phone and a few drone shots. But thanks for watching, we hope you enjoyed it. And sit back and enjoy the rest of our trip across the Gibb River Road. Just to get it back, don't know how it feels to be someone you love and it gets me down, down, down. Yeah, I had you where I wanted you, never had to ask, I'd set the world on fire just to get it back. This is 27, it's 
Start the music, kill the silence Let my mind rest Pour a drink cause it's effective Can't seem to get my head around Why I left you And no one